it is a factual note that today we bringing you the mukbang of the centuries this one is going down in the books years to come it's going down in the books what you see this one is what what do we have here today what meal do we have here today it says we got rigatoni spaghetti with some hawaiian bread and we got some rice on the side too you feel me this is such it's gonna be such this is gonna be such an amazing meal i'm i'm just i'm just feeling it like you know the you can already smell it and you, you can taste the savoriness and we haven't even gotten a bite of the food that's how you know it's going to be good like just the presentation itself right now you can't see the full presentation i'm gonna add like some i'm gonna add an image that way you're able to see like what the food is looking like in the yeah in the hawaiian bread we got some jelly in there so you know that 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 is you feel me? It's go, you know what's going to hit for a factual note. Y'all tuned in today. I'm going to put this down. In a TV, we here with a mug bank today. We bringing the positive energy, you feel me? This way, we are able to connect with our audience. Look at this right here. We are a spirituality channel and today we are adding a mug bang to it so it's like the food must balance because in spirituality you must feed the soul what i say so that way we are able to gain the knowledge and wisdom that our father wants to you know bring into our system before we eat this meal we must pray father lord we thank you for this meal that you are bringing to us today man. As we are about to eat, sanctify the food. That way, we are able to nourish our soul with the goodness of your heart and your mercies. We pray that, Father Lord, we pray that you give a meal to those who don't have a meal today. Father Lord, we are grateful for this meal that we are about to eat. And so are our audience as they are about to tune in to watch this Rangatuni about to be eaten. What I say? Praise be to our Father. Amen. What I say? Look at this. This meal is going to hit. I just know for a fact this meal is going to hit. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna mix the rice up a little bit. You feel me? We're gonna mix the rice up. Get a little bit. You know? Oh, so. I don't know if you you ain't really got to see me yet, but you're gonna see it as we're eating the meal. You're gonna see. Best believe this is the meal of a century. How's it? How's it? How's it end? The taste buds is already kicking. I, I just know that for a fact. Those foodies, yeah, yeah, be foodies. Y'all tune in. The foodies are tuning in. You want to? You want to eat? Okay. Let me give you the first. You feel me? Do you want rigatoni or do you want rice first? So I say we'll go give you some rice first. Eh? You must eat good, eh? Right here. Rigatoon, it's got a chicken mix with green, green peppers, broccoli as well, onions, and some other leafy vegetables. The sauce was a mix of like a tomato sauce 
and a mixture of Alfredo that gives you that creamy feel to the meal itself. You feel me? Be sure to leave a like on this one as we eat this meal and enjoy ourselves. Hopefully, as you've tuned in, you also got a meal that you're also, you know, eating. Mugbang. It's the mugbang stuff, honey. <laughs> What's well, amazing? I'll consider this a very healthy balance. We got some broccoli right here. If you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe for more content like this. Comment down below. Let me know if y'all want to see more mukbangs. You can definitely post on mukbangs. This is probably my second official post on this channel. The work ethic is, is hefty. Partially, you see some YouTubers talk about, oh, consistency. You feel me? But they don't really emphasize like the other key details that you will need. You need a whole bunch of key details this is very spicy. The real tone sauce, very spicy. Also, part of the regular tone joint, chicken. Mm -hmm. Spicy with the chicken mix, your best believe, your best believe. We, do, we really do appreciate everyone that's tuning into the mug bang today. Hopefully you are having a wonderful day, a wonderful evening. These broccolis are very tiny. Emphasis on the chicken. Emphasis on the chicken. <clears throat> Damn, I, I messed up the broccoli. But it's what happened. It's what happened. 
I'm really counting this as a healthy meal. This will help uplift, it, it will uplift your spirit, your soul, your mind. I probably gotta sneeze. <laughs> I probably gotta sneeze just cause. <laughs> Full real spicy. Heavens. Jesus Christ. Mm hmm. The savoriness is, is given. And the spicy, and the spicy is, is given more. It's given more. Imagine, uh, what's the name? Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> you about to say, you just messed up the meal. <laughs> You're not a good enough cook. And you know how he be, he be wilding. He be spazzing on everybody, all the chefs that he be working with. If the meal like goes south for one second, yeah, he, he criticizing you crazy. Let's try out some of this Hawaiian. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. And like I said we got the jelly in the Hawaiian for me. This joint gonna be here. Mm, no cap. <laughs> Hawaiian breast oh god. <laughs> oh my god. Hey yo, I really love ya. I really love ya. It's full spicy too. <laughs> I really do appreciate y'all for tuning in. <laughs> this is such a hefty meal. Hopefully this mukbang hits for sure. You know what I'm saying? Let this one go viral. Mmm, when you get kanzo. Bottom of the rice. For me. Very, very spicy meal. Oh, we got red peppers in here too. It's 
such a pasta. When you are pasta. Italian, 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 Mario. <laughs> know when the pasta is hitting you. <laughs> Start eating like Pac Man at that point. <laughs> you start eating like Pac Man. You get all the power ups you can get. I'm just letting you know. I'm just letting you know ahead of time. The regatum was so good. We just had to make sure that we go and get seconds. We got some chicken left. That's, you know, a little piece of Hawaiian. I'll be right back. Yes, sir. You see now, when the food is so good, you must go for seconds. What I see? That's how you know, sir, the chef that made it. They are cooking. They are, co they are cooking. What does it they are cooking? <laughs> this regatum. Hmm. A different build of pasta. This pasta, why no who said? I'm a dim. I'm one am so. Hmm. Like, relax. That was a broccoli. What a hefty, hefty meal for the mukbang, for the mukbang people. Why did I say? Because usually, when you do a mukbang, I did a mukbang one time, and I got flamed in the comment section. <laughs> They said, how are you going to do a mukbang without showing the food? That's the main part that people wanted to watch. The food. I didn't do the mukbang without the food. <laughs> Mind you, I did it and I had a bowl. <laughs> right now, I'm on a plate. So, you can see the food. But that day, you ain't seeing the food. All you can see is like when I had the... You feel me? And I was eating. So I thought maybe that could that could pass as oh you feel me? You got to see the food while I'm eating it. The people want to see off the plate as well. You feel me? So it's a great thing that damn that is a very hefty piece of garlic. I ain't gonna lie. Should I eat the garlic? Oh, that is crazy. You see how hefty that garlic is? I'm not. I'm not a big fan of garlic, but at this point, for 50, for 50,000 likes, for 50,000 likes, let's go. <laughs> yeah, garlic is just... Mm. You can actually taste it too. Mm. <laughs> well, that's a moment to capture in the mug bank. <laughs> no. As I said, this is going down in the history books. 
I'm going down in the history books for sure. Go chicken, go chicken. That's a little bit of a hefty broccoli. Mm -hmm. The pasta fanatics. The pasta fanatics definitely gotta leave a like on this one. Bro, I still have, I'm still not done chewing the garlic, like what? The secret ingredient. Gotta sprinkle some parmesan on there as well. You feel me? That's what makes the whole meal come together. For being honest. Hold on. We're gonna do our best to clean the plate as the best as possible. I mean, we didn't say itatakimas. <laughs> Arigato. What did I say? For those Japanese people now, you they tune in as well. What say we did inside? Of? No, say we did inside. I'm trying my best. At this point, we might as well just go with hands. At this point. For me, we might as well just go with hands. The point we've reached, we might as well go with hands. Now I'm trying to, you know, make sure this bone is, is properly taken care of. Chewable. Let's find out. We've reached that hefty point of the mugbang. Start to pull heavily on the bones. That's when you know you're getting somewhere when the bones. Good thing is not you know because usually some some of the chicken that like you cook with be having like the hard bone this is like a soft bone chicken so definitely get that great balance of being able to you know I mean? go all the way all the way down to the you know I mean? the nitty gritty of it We learn it, we learn it. This is how you feel more when you got trying to, you know, I'm buying into the food. It's also in the view, kind of. 
I can guarantee you there's probably gonna be a couple people that's gonna complain like, oh, why you, why you eating the food and you can't see it? <laughs> Call me. So usually, when it gets a hefty bone like that, we just bite on it. Take out the middle piece. Put it to the side. Back with another piece of chicken. Mm -hmm. So you know, we had to get into the nitty gritty. As you can see, when, once you start to get to where you're using your hand, you know a meal's good when you start to use your hand. <laughs> when you start to use your hand to eat, yeah, you know that's the meal right there. I'm just letting you know. Now we down to the Hawaiian. It's the, the final half of the Hawaiian. Finish the whole plate. <laughs> I best believe. Oh yeah. We really do appreciate y'all tuning in today to this wonderful month. But you see, when you start to use your hands to eat, that's when you know the meal is here. Just for that. Y'all gotta put a thumbs up. A thumbs up on this one, you feel me? Put a thumbs up on this one. Before the video begin. And if you've reached this far in the video as well, be sure to leave a thumbs up. I'm saying like, double thumbs up, you feel me? Make sure y'all share this one as well. It gets to reach others, they get to see the entertainment, the edutainment as well, you feel me? We have Nourish. The spirit, the soul, the mind, the vessel. I'll tell you, I'll because to acquire the wisdom of our father as innate, you know that the special rigatoni rice Hawaiian special, this is how it must be, you feel me? It must be nourished into the vessel. That's why this one's called mugbang. <coughs> oh, 
Also, don't forget to subscribe. You feel me? I really do appreciate everybody that tuned into this one right here. Continue to show love, support. We're gonna grow this channel. Our next goal, I'm saying our next goal, 500 subscribers. Like, for real, let's get to that ASAP. Let's get to that 500 subscribers ASAP. We got this. We got this. 500 subscribers. Next, after that, 1K. Like, we really on to this. Then the mukbangs, because at that point, the mukbangs is coming through, like, consistently. You feel me? Y'all want to see more content? Y'all know what to do. If you're looking forward to seeing more mukbangs and creative content, this is the channel for you. So y'all, y'all tune in. Y'all tune. I'm just saying, y'all tune in. Tap in for a factual note. Be sure to leave a like on this one. Subscribe, share with your family, everybody, so they get to see such amazing content. This mukbang right here, as I said, century upon century. It's going down in the books. It's going down in the books. It's going down in the books. <laughs> Y'all stay tuned. We're going to see y'all in the next one. Gra, gra. Boop.